Hello everyone and welcome to <clears throat> my next video and yes as brilliant as I believe I am I actually noticed another blunder I actually sold the great helmet that I actually wanted to give to someone in my party so yes I just continue with one blunder after another and I'm not gonna blame it on on well stage fright because I'm doing all this video and stuff but I do believe it has some kind of influence on me but let's just say I believe it, it was the influence of the evil horses yes damn it that great helmet actually was really nice and oh that's pretty that's quite a speed rating and Melatine horse bow. That may seem something that is good for eat it. Hmm. 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 Yes, this goes to eat it. I believe this is a very good bow and a very rare one at that too. Yeah, I don't really feel inclined of wasting that kind of money on a helmet that I can always drop well okay not really always but that I can drop often enough from from bandits and really excuse me alright there you go wait did Julia just teleport whoa she was grabbing my muscles she probably hired that drunk just so she could grab my awesome muscles. Yes, okay, it was yesterday in the afternoon. He was walking home. He was told that an entire the shark camp now stands empty. They know, and no one knows what became of the people there. They simply disappeared. Yes, that may be the work of Burulgi the usurper. And we have Julia back in our midst. Excellent. Oh yes. This is quite a considerable improvement. Speed suffers a little bit. Accuracy is about the same. But the damage and power draw is quite different. So very good and we will now head to Valenbrae to find that hidden stash no no oh everyone leaves far too quickly sell off some things and then we will make our way to Nordor Woods and see if we can better our relationship with the Nordor. Oh, that's a bad price for salt. And all right, let's. That's not a good price for fish either. Why do we really need that many horses? And these two books are annoying, quite annoying. I wish there was some kind of auto sort in the inventory. I'm not a big fan of auto loot, however, I just think that looting and assigning things personally just makes the looting all the more sweeter and no that is actually quite far from where the hidden stash is I believe if I use this yes this is quite the shortcut and this is quite a nice view I really like Valenbrae and how it was done 
and I believe that on your computer it will look so much more better than on mine. Yeah. Oh wow. Uh oh okay, that's a lot of good things and a lot of crap. <laughs> um yes, okay, let's get the crap first and wait, I, I'm not supposed to say that. <clears throat> um well a lot of less useful stuff and let's get rid of the less useful stuff first. And then I need to make my way once more to the hidden stash. And oh, this is actually quite the work. I have little space. Maybe I can sell something. Oh, rain actually has quite a good price. And oh, wow, bread is quite worth a bit here. Yeah, so let's make a little bit more space. Fruit is not a good price. Cheese is okay, so let's sell that cheese as well yes now I'll have a lot more space and now I need to go there once more that is actually a little bit tedious and I have agility 20 and athletic 6 now actually I wish I would have gotten that athletics bonus from that mysterious event later Maybe even to max out my athletics to 10, but, well, alas. And thick, fierce vein, fierce vine breastplate over mail. That is actually quite nice. Some really, really excellent gauntlets and mittens. And, yes, that is actually quite nice. I do not think anyone has need of these. Should I just keep it around? Well, first things first, I will offer Lethalderan this helmet. No, wait, actually he has a better helmet already. So, uh, but he can use these gauntlets, I believe. Yes. Oh, wow, that is quite a difference. And he shall be so much more dangerous now, much more durable, anyway. Except that he may need a much, much better helmet. So does mm, Riva, but actually that's not so bad. And... Wait, I think that Boadis gets the first choice of... Thick black steel gauntlets. Yes. And these lordly black steel greaves also go well with her look. So congratulations, buddies. Iron greaves, these dark shin balls go now to you. These gauntlets are not the best, but they are still well. So Jocelyn. So Alistair. Knight of the Eventide. Well, he's pretty much... Ooh, I still... Neglected to upgrade his chipped Morningstar. And he does not need that heretic kite shield. And ooh, he... Oh, he wouldn't use heretic, a heretic kite shield. You get these gauntlets. These iron greaves. Very nice. What? Why does he have that Warhammer? Ah, actually, maybe sometimes we could use the blunt weapon damage, but yes, not at the moment. Five. Donovan. Okay. Oh, that's not a very good helmet, but it's still better than we have here. 5317. Well, it still goes well, but the Empire Nightplate does look really 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 awesome oh both do not really fit Edith 
but you get new male boots, you get... Oh, now it looks much better, but this helmet doesn't really fit him. He just doesn't mind using the heretic shield, that is funny. And okay. I still have one set of very thick armor. And I have no idea who to give it to. Everyone seems to be quite well. Wait. Julia 4714. Ooh. Ooh, okay. That doesn't really look too bad. Yes, she's well equipped otherwise. Oh, she could use a better bow and some new arrows, but that is not so bad. Anyone who needs new gloves? Leslie, what gloves do you have? Okay, okay, I admit. Now upgrading the equipment is a little bit tedious when you have to check the gloves that everyone is wearing. I admit that. I admit that. Okay. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm Let's see. Can I get to Um no. I'm running out of space. Running out of space and things to sell. Well, wait, that's wrong. The traders are running out of dinners to purchase. This ebony dueling sword seems nice, but the weapon reach is not very good. But this heavy morning star may go to Sir Alistair now, I think. So yay you, and he's probably gonna leave me just a few days after he gets his new shining morning star. The ungrateful twit. And 80, okay, you. I'll give you those four dinars. Oh really? The people look well fed and relatively content. I notice that it is not possible to switch to melee modus with these assassin throwing knives. <clears throat> okay, loot. Oh no! Just these two items that I cannot. Okay, now I have some problem because I cannot sell the remaining loot for profit anymore. Okay, so I will need to take the loot with me to a different city. Hmm, this view looks strangely familiar, don't you think? This must be a deja vu. Oh, I think I've met you before. Okay, so this took some time. Hopefully it wasn't too boring. Okay, okay, it was boring, I know. But this is part of the game and well, I do enjoy re-equipping my people. And these Vanskeries are annoying. So what do I do? 
Oh, that's a good price for spice. That is surprisingly good. And they have a lot of money. That must be through all my... Through my sponsorship of flags. Do you have anything? Oh, a Rusty Fields Vine Berserker Sword. That is nice. And uh, oh, it's good to know to know that they have more reach than my sword. I will have to keep that in mind. Let's see if there's anyone interesting here. Maiden Water. No. Anything uh, yes. new? The price of velvet is up by 50% because the traders have to pay so many guards to get the caravans here safely. They pass the cost right onto the customer too. Well, that is unfortunate. And I don't really quite care. But let's not forget... Well, not... You don't probably forget, I always do. So, our job now is to get to Noldor territory and see if we can earn their trust earn more of their trust and ooh these black coven are about to engage me and I have little space for loot but I will have to take them on I will have to free these two farmers uh, yes Yes, you have a very strange voice, do you know that? For gl glory! <laughs> yes. No worries, we will take care of you. It's so funny that I actually am not really that much more powerful than before, but I am feeling more and more confident in maneuvering my naked berserker so the huge question is what shall I do with those heretic minions who are just yes the dammit cavalry are actually sidetracking my people oh he took quite the beating that's heretic Magnus Oh, he's dead, okay. Okay, okay, charge everyone. Wait, that's my own guy. Damn you! How dare you! How dare you thrust your crap at me! Yes! I'm on a roll and I'm still alive! Wow, I I think that Iron Flash has done quite a, the difference. Well, if you do not have any armor, then the only thing that can save you is hit points and yes these I just survived an assassin assassination attempt by this horse I'm not imagining it they're after me everyone's after me and ooh, well not really excellent drops and oh there I get a good morning star not excellent drops but still good drops well, at least they're worth quite a bit of dinars, denars, dinars, denars. I, I still cannot decide. The last time I looked, the last time I checked the dictionary, it said it's pronounced dinars. But it's just... I don't really like it. I like... I prefer denars, I believe. Hail, Lord Captain! I wish you joy of the victory. Say, Lethaldoran lives up to the Noldor reputation of being unstoppable warriors, doesn't he? He covered my back in our latest battle and saved me an injury or worse. It goes to show that prejudice is often misplaced. 
You'll never hear praise of the Noldor in the Empire. It's good to know that you two are getting along so well. So, Julia is quite charmed by our dear Noldor assassin. Sadly, that doesn't improve my relationship with the Noldors. No one has need of that helmet. I believe I can ignore that particular I need more food and they have a heavy warhammer. Ah. Huh. Do I want that? Do does somebody need that? Well, I could equip my knightly people with some blunt weapons in case we go on, I don't know, a special spy hunt. And Alright, let's get it. I do have a little bit of money to spare. And I believe that many of you would probably say invest into armor, you idiot. And when he was getting some fresh air, he said that he had gawped in awe at the latest work of Alain de Mo Armorer, but could never hope to afford it. Who's Alain de Armorer? I have no idea. I've never run into him. So, buddies, besides your Empire Arming Sword, you will... Oh, I'll have to take away her throwing weapons, that is quite a pity, and Sir Jocelyn will may be leaving me, as he's not really a regular, I believe. And, okay, well, I do have a lot of money. I am, my inventory is clean, I still need to get rid of these heretics. I will ransom them to their family. And then I'm off to Nordor lands. Anything nice to buy? Ooh, Masterwork Long Composite Bow. That actually might almost be worth the buy. Huh. Hmm. I think it will be quite some time until I can find enough Norder composite bows. And until then, this Masterbird long composite bow would be quite good. But actually, I noticed that Power Draw 8 is quite steep. I have no idea who would be able to use that right away. DF, maybe? Hmm. But these are really, really rare, huh? I'm undecided. Ah, oh, let's trust in my in my luck of getting good loot. So I will just leave it. No red brotherhood. More brigands. And uh, yes, okay, so while I need to, while I head to Noldor lands, I can actually pick up some Empire recruits and start training them. Perfect, five people start training them for, to become Empire armored pikemen. And hopefully they survive. Oh, someone's leaving. Oh! Hmm, we are a trifle close to my home territory for my comfort. But I admit I've missed these woods. I've hunted here often as a lad. I do find it difficult being surrounded by humans rather than amongst my own kind. Have you any idea, have you any idea how foul most of you smell? No, the cleanliness stun standards are vastly higher than those of humans. I also miss our music. Your clumsy pipes and whistles cannot compare to a Noldor flute, and your croaking is by and large unmelodious. 
Well, thank you for your appreciation. Back up, yes. I believe I'm at neutral with the Nordors, aren't I? Yes, I am. Quickly, quickly, let's help them. Quickly, no, Jetu, do not fail. And Wolfbow, oh my gosh, Wolfbow launches a surprise attack against Points Brock. And Reva sees fit to leave me in the woods. No. And okay, let's aid the right people. I believe I am quite opposed to the Jatu. What? Only nine people left? Damn it. Damn it. Yeah, the Nordor will make quick work of the Jatu. Oh, Jatu, I really need to, yes, practice the blocking. I need to practice fighting them on foot and naked as well anyway. I will probably be fighting them quite a lot. Damn it, too fast, and that damn lance is really, really, really long. Uh, the two honor lands reach 220, that is almost insane. I mean, my all pike had a reach of 165. Yes, that's quite a disadvantage to fight them on foot with a weapon that is shorter than their armor lances. Maybe it would be a good idea to invest into a pike just for fighting the Jatu. Oi, Captain, I was just having a chat with Julia. I never cared much for those of the Empire considering the Noldor history with them. But exceptions seem to be the rule in this company. Oh yes. Have you heard her story? Imagine having to kill one's own brother after finding one's whole family was enmeshed with the snake cult. Of course, a lot of the Empire citizens are snakes on the sly, I'm told. Still, she did very well. That is very nice. I still need... This Nordor house, let's accompany them. And yes, Ethereum, yeah, I do not believe I can do much. Unfortunately, you cannot even talk to him. There is no option to talk to him, get any quests, or do something more. We will see that probably in the next version of Prophecy of Pandora. What are you doing? They are chasing that caravan. Will they catch up? Oh, they will actually catch up. They are pretty fast. Even though they just got littered with useless prisoners. Oh, maybe I should have taken the prisoners and disbanded them. Just so they wouldn't slow down this Nolda patrol. Well, I will do that the next time. And... Excuse me, sir. Sir, I've seen more bloodshed than I can bear. I have money now re to return to Barclay and I'll never soldier again. Goodbye and thank you for rescuing me from that tavern. Uh, Leslie's leaving. Oh, She's stuck around for quite a long time, actually. What the... What the hell? They almost caught up to the caravan and then they were chasing after those 14 brigands. Let's assist the Nordors and while I do not quite approve in attacking caravans, I believe I can... Oh, the Nordor tell me that the caravan are suspect of dealing with Noldor trade goods, stolen Noldor trade goods, they're corrupt. Yes, I'm still a champion of justice. <laughs> yes, corrupt merchants. Oh, well, actually, it is a single caravan, so it does really go well with the corrupt indictment. They're probably slave traders, human traffickers working in secret for 
Ramoon, well, I've had my trainings with him as well, but I do not approve in the. I do not approve of the selling of females of any race. Oh, that horse is still alive. Oh, already dead. Wow. Sir Rain, what are you doing? Stop running around in circles. Okay. Well, that was it. Thank you for your help. Well, thank you too. And yes, let's not get these... Empire people killed blue rampant lion circo. That is quite a nice emblem name and a nice emblem as well, of course. But yes, the protection is considerably less good. And Pointsbrook is no longer under siege from Wolfboat. Maybe there are fighting Wolfboat. I want to take a look at what's happening there is someone fighting Wolfboat? has he been defeated there's Duke Aldemar or did Wolfboat abandon his siege I have no idea let's check he should still be yeah epitome of ineptitude thank you very much to remind me of that yes Wolfboat is still around Yep, he's disappeared. I have no idea. He probably broke off the siege of Pointsbrook. Seeing as it was quite well defended still. Well, since I'm near Pointsbrook, I might as well just sell off some loot and... We of Martenheim never pass up a challenge. Are you ready to die today? Yes, let us kill them all and show us. Let the bloodletting begin. <laughs> oh great, now I ran into a Mettenheim expeditionary force and I don't know why they are actually attacking us. I mean we do have Frederick in our midst and we never did anything to, to well, um, offend them. Oh my, I hope this doesn't end with a capture, but I believe, well, we are only 13 people. That is actually not very promising. Oh yes, that is quite menacing. That's a huge blob of armored shit. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of... Wow, I, I can still miss with my daggers throwing in the middle of that. They're fast, damn it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they will... I'm not getting any kills, even with my assassin throwing daggers. Oh, um, yes, run. Where were they? Oh, they were hiding. Oh, look at that. Yes, they are almost invisible in that snow that just that's just really evil. I suggest more cunning and less blundering on the battlefield next time. I am sorry. Yes, that was quite a blunder. And now I'm not even at full health to participate in the tournament. And oh my gosh, look at this. This is a rare thing. Rusty Doom Guide leather. It, it does look really 
Sexy. Well, not on me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no. But this one would actually go well with any of my female companions. And it is super light. It's rusty, but I will invest that money. You don't find these often. Ooh, silver mist plate and chain. It's not really that great. But, okay, let's have that rusty... Rusty leather. How is that actually possible? <laughs> okay. Okay, oh, long spear. This one actually has quite the reach compared to Jatu honor lances. Wait, but I'm not sure. Honor lances, do they actually have reach 220? No, I think that was the normal knight lance, and I believe that the honor lances do have. Oh, yes, great lance has 240, so actually, this isn't really. Yeah, I think I will need to deal with the. I need to deal with the Jatu differently. Yeah. So I'm at 36%, yes, and I have lost a few people and I've lost... No, I didn't lose any of my backup. And they are chasing me. Why are they opposed to me? I have no idea. Oh, they did fight with Wolf Boat's patrol, I think. Although there's no sign of Wolf Boat himself. And I shall leave. And really, Frederick, can't you talk to your own people? Why would your people actually even attack me especially with you and my troop I seem to have a very bad reputation hopefully I can rectify that and make peace with the Mettenheim as well now I need to look for that particular Nolda patrol I cannot find them and I will be a little bit more careful again the Jatu are rampant running rampant through these lands Yes, there, for example. I wonder if these will engage me. Well, I'm not a very good health. I do not want to fight them, actually. Oh, they're running after me. 37, the two. That's actually... That will be quite a difficult battle. No, I do not feel like doing it. How fast are they anyway? They're pretty fast. I'm faster. Wahaha. <laughs> Okay, let's not be cowardly. I haven't had a challenging fight for a long time, so um, this video shall soon end too. So I will take on these as the end of the video. And no, don't leave me just before I'm about to fight them. Oh, he is. Oh, he's not. Okay, I believe that is encouragement to take on this challenging fight oh my gosh hopefully this goes well hopefully i can make use of the river fight do you really think you're all that terrifying ha oh yes do you see a river i don't see a river There's a river. Okay. Okay, I, I, I don't really get much use of the river. Ooh, this looks much better. This looks very good indeed. Let's make this into a mud fight.
And there they are. Oh my gosh, they're very, very fast. Oh, I cannot help. They already are engaging my people in... Let's hope I don't run into any lands. Shit. Oh no, oh no. Damn it, wrong direction, ouch. Oh, really? He survived my blow and... They, their swords actually should have short reach. I have no idea how that still hit me. Uh, no excuse. I lost in melee. In a one-on-one -on -one melee. Well, of course, I was in water, so actually retreating didn't really put, put up enough distance, maybe. That was it, actually. Which means I would need more practice fighting in the water. Oh, I'm I'm having a lot of casualties, a lot, a lot. Oh my gosh! And of course, my backup is all dead. <laughs> uh. Oh boy, these got knocked out. Please, please, and. Are you Frederick? Oh, that is Frederick. He's... He's just... Well, standing in the water, near the water, and... No! Oh no, he's gonna get lanced. No, he's not gonna get lanced! Can you not retreat a little bit? I need to tell them to stop using their... Yes! Stop using your crossbows! Oh, okay. This looks good because the other, the remaining Jatu are all on foot. And oh, that's my gladiator. It's incredible. He's been with me like for an eternity. He's been with me for a very long time. No, you idiot! Oh, ooh, wow. Sorry, I call for calling you idiot. He just took out that. <laughs> Two-handed sword while he was getting attacked, so I was getting worried. But he blocked, actually. I didn't think he could block. Wow, he's having some oven mitts. <laughs> he's having some mill mitts. Oh, incredible. That gladiator is incredible. What's your name, gladiator? Maximus! Splendid. <laughs> Oh wow, that was a very nice fight and there are only few people left and oh I can check the length, oh it's balanced 243, it's marginally shorter than that spear, that, that long spear that I saw. It, it doesn't really change the fact that the long spear is not really a good weapon then. Oh my gosh. Balanced Jatu on our lands. These are rare, but you can get them quite often enough. Jatu heavy saber, yes, all they all all their sabers have short reach. Must have been the water that didn't really put enough distance between me and that one swing. So yes. A challenging fight we were there was a chance that we would actually lose and I'm very happy that we didn't of course and yes I am actually putting a little bit into into this into weapon mastery although I generally think weapon mastery is quite a waste of course it is not if you use it for I believe no one has strength 25 
Yes, no one. Uh, what do I do? No one can use the lands. No one's good enough. Uh, yes. Well, actually, no one can use any of this stuff. That's a little bit of a down, of a downer for me. Well, let's get to Laria and sell off the loot and. What? Bloodbath? We only lost one third of mm, our men. <laughs> okay. But we emerged victoriously. How much renown did I actually get from that battle? 11. So it's fine. I don't know. Well, what's your problem? And even wounded as we are, we can still drive off some wayfarers. And it's almost a pity to sell off all this stuff. And it's, I know it's not, it's always al also a pity that I don't use lances for my troops. And is there anything nice do you, that you have for me? No. No. Ooh, that is a strange helmet. And yes. Um, hmm. Yeah. So that's how things look. No one here. No one. Yep. Nothing new for me. Okay, so thank you for watching and uh, hopefully that very last battle was a little, had a little suspension for you. Well, I for one wasn't quite sure that I would be winning. And yes, so thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye bye.